What is up guys? Born by the Brick here doing another review. Uh, this time we'll be doing a surprise box review. This time we'll be reviewing a loot crate, which is pretty cool. And we'll also be doing a what up box. What? So yeah. Oops. Fell out. But yeah, let's pretty much get this started. Let's hide that in there so we don't find out. Uh, yeah, um, right now I'm going to start with let's the what up box. box opened. Alright, first we can see that uh, open share, all that good stuff. Oh my gosh, this is freaking adorable. We get a Kirby plushie, and that is for the month of February. Transform! Because you know how Kirby sucks in the monsters and then transform into them. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He's got the little. Oh my gosh, he's bean based. Oh, this is so adorable. You guys have to get a loot crate. These ones are really cool. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna feel him on his face. Oh, he's so adorable. All right, let's uh, let's put Kirby right here. All right, and so yeah. And then, oh my gosh, what is this? Oh man. Oh, Spider Man. Awesome. Let me open this up. This is one up box right there. So let us unwrap this. You don't need scissors for this. Let's do this. Alright, so I got it open. And let us see what this looks like. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. So yeah, this is super cool. I'm, I'm definitely going to wear this to work uh, today. It feels like a kind of cheap metal, but that's okay. It's really cool. Um, yeah, so yeah. I'm gonna put that right there too, like right next to Kirby. Um, let's check out the T-shirt actually right now. Um, so this one is a extra extra large. Okay, so that's good. I'm I'm a tubby guy. I'm a pretty tubby guy. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh, this is super cool. This is like Mega Man. It's pretty cool. And then you got the health bar right there. You got the shield. Oh my gosh, this is super cool. Alright, let's put that right there. What else do we got? Awesome. Adventure Time Jake sweatband guys. This is I need a sweatband. I don't care what kind of sweatband it is. I am a big fan of sweatbands because I perspire a lot at work. It's a pers pers perspiration band. Let me see. So we got it right there. So this is pretty cool. It's Jake the dog, and it's cool because you know Jake the dog can transform into anything he wants pretty practically. So he transformed himself into a sweatband, and that is really cool. Props on you guys, one out box, on following through with your transform theme. Just put this. In. Oh my gosh, yes, that is adorable. I'm wearing that to work, guys. You know it. It's real. What else do we get? We get this cool. Awesome Mario sticker sheet. What is this? So yeah, um, I think you can put these on your window. They look like it. You get the mushroom star, the feather, uh, all the cool things. All right, so put that right there. Oh my gosh, cool! And then we got another one. We got a um, exclusive tattoos. You can put them on your neck. You got the Hulk transformer and Iron Man transformer. So that is really cool. Oh uh, yeah. And then here is the little uh, sheet that you get for the theme of 1UP box. Alright, so number one is Kirby. Uh, Transforms, Hulk, Metallic, Tattoo, the Transformers, Mutant, Spider-Man, Necklace, Better Time, Sweatband. Um, oh yeah, so these are window decals, so they have those, right? And then this one is a Mega Millionaire t-shirt, so that's awesome. Alright, and so yeah, let us look at the loot crate. I nearly forgot. The badge for this one up box is oh my gosh, that's adorable. We get Hulk on a wrecking ball, haha, <laughs> kind of like Miley Cyrus. So that is pretty funny, and yeah, it's a pin that you get there. Right, and then let, now let's so check here out that is loot this crate. month's loot crate. It is dead for February in honor of Deadpool, um, and also uh, The Walking Dead, of course. Cause we gotta get a second one in there. I really I watched Deadpool on. Uh, uh, the the night before it released, so it was the 11th. I watched it on the 11th of February, so that was pretty cool. So let's uh, crack this open. Let's see what we get. Oh wow, that's cool. All right, so of course yeah, we're in there. So we get a Q fig. What is this Q? So this is a in one of their new you know final figures. So this is a loot crate exclusive Q fig. Deadpool, Deadpool on the side, Deadpool on the back, eating, blazing, doorknobs of death, banana face, random jargon that only Deadpool would understand. 
Uh, yeah. Uh, Here is Deadpool. Um, it's like blowing up China from fire and flames, you know. Uh, this reminds me of a scene in the Deadpool movie, actually. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah. Tell me if you guys know what scene I'm talking about it, though, in the comments. Honestly, this feels like more of a kid pool than a dead pool, really. He he does kind of look like the overly sized head kind of makes it more of a kid pool than a dead pool to me. But again, it's just my opinion. On the back, Q fig. So these ones are pretty cool, and it's a Luke Lee exclusive, of course. And he's got the dual katanas. There's a signature dual katanas and the dead pool uh, belt right there. Also, let's get to the next item. Let's put them right there. And then we do uh, get a t-shirt, which is pretty bad looking, pretty awesome, super duper super cool looking. Oops, where to go? Let me get this. It is Deadpool yelling tacos! Upside down, that is, that is pretty funny. Yeah, and then look at the back, nothing right there. Yeah, let's put that right there. Now what do we got? We got a loot crate pin. Now that is pretty cool, Dead. And then it's got the pin right there. I like these ones a lot more than the loot crate ones. If they had pins, it would be cooler. Yeah, uh, yeah it's just like a little, you know, um, I think it's like a loot. Oh, I see. It's a loot crate that's dead. That's risen from the grave. Haha, <laughs> very, very good loot crate. Right, and then we have this um, random Walking Dead figures, so there's multiple of them. Um, oh, and it's McLaren, so that's pretty cool. McLaren does make some pretty cool toys. Uh, you know what, let's just, uh, I'll jump cut this and see when it's uh, just a little open. buildable figure. And he was a little bit of a pain to put together. Um, sometimes he clicks part, sometimes he doesn't. Yeah, but yeah, he looks really burnt. He looks like a burned victim straight up. Oh, yeah, so you got the attachment right there. And then you get this little base right here. Oh, I see. So it's, it's kind of like Lego compatible, I guess. With You know, it's not really Lego, but it is just another kind of those buildable uh, figures that's that they have. Yeah. So you just got another walker, I guess. So that's okay. Not really to complain about. I don't watch much of The Walking Dead, really, but I should. I really should. Let's get to the next item. Oh, what do we got here? Um, soap? Soap on a rope. Daryl's Walker's ear necklace. Oh, okay, so it's soap. So, I don't know if I'm going to be using this really. Like, I don't know if I'll t smell like a zombie or something. Um, or I'll attract zombies. So, so yeah. Um, corpse. Essence of co riding corpse. That's what they should put there. <laughs> All right, and so let's actually just open this up because I'm really interested in what they smell like. Uh, so, let's see. Come on, don't be a, don't be a baby about this. There you go. Soap on a rope. So let's. Like, are you kidding me? Like, is this real? Is this, is this for real? <laughs> Will people actually be using this or what? Oh my gosh, this is so weird. Like, who, who would make this? Oh, it smells awful. I don't know if it's just been in the packaging or something, but this is honestly, like, I wouldn't use this as soap, honestly. Like, honest to God, like, I don't even want to use this as hand soap either. Like, this is just, like, straight-up rank. Or, not rank, but it just doesn't smell good. Should've just kept it in the packaging, yo. So, that's, that's, um, that's something for another day. I'll, 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 I'll see how it works, but, yeah. And then, at the bottom, what, let us see what we get. We just get this little, uh, manual right here. Survive Guide to the Zombie Apocalypse. Um, let me... Zoom in. So yeah, if you want to read this, just um, pause the video, and then I'll pause the video right here too if you want. So yeah, it's a really nifty little um, just kind of guide of how you would survive. And then here's Deadpool. So I uh, wade into the Deadpool. So Wade Wilson, Post Weapon X, 
a tad crazy. He sees you. BFFs and true love. Yeah, true love is uh, her. So this is the uh, mega loot crate worth two thousand dollars. It's pretty cool. And which Walking Dead character are you? Alright, and so... You know, I'm going to take this test, and I am going to see which character I am. Folks, it turns out I'm Carol, and I'm apparently a female. Uh, but that's beside the point. You're Carol, you deliver lethal vengeance and threats when necessary, but with a side door of delicious homemade cookies as a bribe, it's a fair trade. Okay, yeah, this is straight up me. I love co making cookies, and they're delicious. So yeah, let's go to the next page. Oh my gosh, I want a Rick and Morty um, loot crate. That'd be so cool. Oh, iZombie. Yep, yeah, Rob Zombie. Uh, not Rob Zombie, but iZombie is one of my favorite shows. You guys should definitely watch it. Again, it's just more. Oh my gosh, that's super cool. Exclusive variant. That's pretty cool. And so, yeah, let's. um. Let's see what the bottom of this is. This is actually, um, because I know you can flip the loot crates inside out, so let me try you doing oh, this I one. did it. I kept the roof up here, so yeah, we got the little house building, and then you have the zombies right here. Um, this is a really cool one. Watch, listen, play, more dead. Again, and then the concrete floor. So yeah, uh, tell me guys what you think about, uh, me doing these loot crates. Do you love them? Do you hate them? Or do you have any suggestions? And, um... I also have a referral link down in the description below. Um, I definitely appreciate it if you guys would um, uh, just like try out Loot Crate for one month or whatever. Uh, it's a lot of fun and I'll definitely support you guys. Like I love um, you guys watching my videos. I really appreciate it and I plan on doing a very special giveaway uh, once I reach 100 subscribers. Again, thank you guys for all the love you guys are giving me and um, again, just keep on breaking on. Uh, yeah. You guys have a good day, okay? Peace!